It's okay, daddy's here. What'd you say? <clears throat> Shut up. Before I spit in your mouth. All right, y'all, as promised, we are starting a new series today. This is episode one. In the comments, tell me your favorite home cooked meal. As you know, I cooked this on live the other day and I figured it'd be the first and best thing to start this series on. Season your chicken with fajita seasoning, pepper, cayenne pepper, Lowry seasoning, salt, garlic powder, and a double complete seasoning. Pat it in on both sides of the chicken. When you're done patting it in, add it to a bowl. Yeah, like so. Take some soy sauce, brown sugar, cane syrup, and sriracha hot sauce. Mix it all together with your hands. Put it on a baking sheet and bake it at 400 for about 50 minutes. For the mashed potatoes, take some red potatoes, butter, cheese, sour cream, pepper, and salt. Literally nothing crazy. Add parsley if you like. Mash it up. When the chicken hits 50 minutes, take it out and glaze it in barbecue sauce. Serve it. Beautiful. I'm starting a new series for all of the people who don't like to cook, but they love to have meals at home like me. So first, we boil our water. Then we add in some penne noodles. These ones are from Trader Joe's. They're brown rice and they're so good. Then we add in some marinara sauce. This one is unmatched. I always do a little bit of greens or some meat and that is literally it. Hey, I'm gonna show you guys how to make the perfect baked chicken breast. Let your chicken rest room temp 20 minutes, then hit it with olive oil or melted butter, both sides, your favorite seasoning. Here's what I use, guys. I just keep it simple. Into the oven, 450, 15 to 17 minutes, 165 internal temp. Let it rest for five minutes, at least five minutes before you cut into it, guys. I make this every week for meal prep. It's so easy and delicious. Here's one of my favorite ways to make healthy chicken and rice taste really delicious. Get some chicken breast, add olive oil, salt, pepper, garlic powder, smoked paprika, mixed herbs, Mix till each piece is well coated. Then in a hot pan, add your chicken, cook for two minutes, then flip. Lower the heat and add a can of chopped tomatoes. Season again, then cover and let it simmer for 10 minutes. Then you're ready to serve with some hot rice and you got yourself a delicious, healthy meal. Enjoy. I don't understand women who can't cook. And I ain't talking about cooking for a man, bitch. I'm talking about cooking for yourself. Like, I feel like cooking is a skill that you should know regardless of gender. You need to be able to make you something good to eat. Period. You must follow Food TikTok. Knowing how to make food from a box is not good enough. Knowing how to order food online is not impressive. Come to Food TikTok and I will show you how to cook such amazing food that your friends and family. I'm on a mission to eat less takeout. So when we had a craving for Chick-fil-A, I decided to make it at home. I sliced my chicken breast thin and put it in pickle juice and I let it marinate for
So that last thing that you saw were my chopsticks. 